It's a girl queen at Hubert in Hollywood Milkshake. It's your favorite boy, Jerry Williams. And I'm here to let you know where to watch, I mean, bangers, action movies. I need you all to subscribe to Arrow Dreams Nolly TV on YouTube. And trust me, you watch Nollywood movies, is gonna be interesting. Love you guys. Relaxed here as what? The woman of the house or what? Are you mad? What the hell is wrong? Are you with mad? You? I'm asking you. Are you mad? Alone? The more reason one shouldn't date his or her neighbor. Have you seen it? Grandma. Have you seen Sugar this mommy, girl? Leave my man alone. See, forget about whatever lies he would have told you. Of course, you know how men lie. We've made love everywhere in this house, including this place. Of you are mad. You and who? Me and you. You what? are. Babe, don't, don't, don't even listen to this fool. She's obviously lying. Keep denying it. Are you mad? Keep denying it. After I've gotten two pregnancies with you, you think I, I would allow her to come and take you like that? Jesus no Jesus Christ. I, I, I'll slap this girl. Oh, please. I'll, are you mad? I bought, I, bought, I bought one for who? I know you would deny it now. Keep denying it. She will abandon you and go. Then you'll come back crawling to me as always. Is it's it not you again? Is it not you again? Oh, woman. I am talking and you chose to ignore me. As what? Manuela. Okay. <laughs> Emanuela is getting married. It's an invitation. Really? See for yourself. Okay. Wow. Awesome. Aww. Oh, I love this detail. Marriage is a beautiful boy. By God, it is so tidy and What? Me? Rubbish. What's that? This one is just wasting her time. Just look at this. Oh, she wants you to be her maid of honor. She should better think twice, because that's nonsense. Who's going to be her maid of honor? Is this not her trying to insult me? I don't understand. Why will you understand? No, you never get to understand things like this. Sure, you know. Once it's about things like this, you don't understand. Ellen. Emanuela is your cousin and your friend. A very good friend at that. If she wants you to be around, which is why I think she's asking you to be her maid of honor, I absolutely think it's fine. Listen, if she wants me to attend her wedding, that's fine by me. But asking me to be her maid of honor doesn't work for me. How can she even expect that of me? <laughs> you do have your reasons, don't you? Jane, I am 40 plus. How old is Emanuela? She's 30. Can you not see the difference? Can't you see the gap? Ellen, Emanuela is your cousin and your blood. There is nothing wrong in your sister asking you to be her maid of honor. I mean, absolutely nothing. Why are you making an issue out of nothing? Jane, everything is wrong with Emanuela's request. How can she even expect that of me? 
The last wedding we attended, we were in the train together. And I made it clear to her. I pointed it out that that was the last wedding I was ever going to be in the train. And she knew I was serious. Why would she come asking for this? That's rubbish. If you ask me, I don't see it that way. Why would you see it that way? I don't see it that way. Is that I don't see it that way. You're not going to force me to see things from your own side of the coin. Uh -uh. You will not see things from my own side of the coin. Why will you see it that way? I'm not asking you, so no need to see it that way. Well, you were, and I have to respond. I don't see it that way, girl. Uh -uh. See, you next imagine, my just they tell you now, so you they hear me. As you see me elsewhere, me and you know be rich me for anything. Me and, me and now they talk, see, see, I don't drop NG before you even think of saying you walk out, they do mechanic work. As you see me for years, I get back account too. I get back account. You get BVN. So if somebody like me, Richard, there, they talk. As far as I say, not did this workshop. You suppose nothing I mean they control every every. So if I they talk, you suppose keep your mouth shut. Wait, I don't understand. What in what you come bring this one now? So make if you don't talk, make I not talk. Unto Jesus. No, nine Jesus. What is your problem? Do you know? Uh, the problem you have is you only think of today. You don't think about your future. You don't think about tomorrow. You don't know what tomorrow will look like. So let me tell you, as I did like this now, I better pass you where where. <laughs> next thing you get future. No. Now you only use. Okay. So next thing you know say you get future. Now you get mine. Can't money go rent us for where they no get lights. How that one take you? You get future, you know they use Android phone. You know get radio, you know get TV. And you say you get fish up. Anyway, I know they I know go blame you because not be everybody for this life will get fish up. So your own no shock me. So but if at the talk, you're not supposed to the open mouth, they talk. You don't understand? Yeah. You get fish up and on a red cover, you know if you buy. Musa when you die. If to say family people no forget this thing for you now, I will wonder what you for the year. And you get fish up. No, now your own. I won't I won't, I won't borrow your own. Dip to your guy. See your life now. See your bar hair. Dip to your guy. I see you, Nashibi. You're just here, you're just here, parading yourself like as if you're a mechanic, whereas you're just a Yahoo Yahoo. Jobless one. Whenever I even see, see, you're just deceiving yourself. See, you should be hiding yourself in shame if I were you. <laughs> That's where they advise me. It's too funny, I beg. You go to hide yourself for shame. But when I go to bring chicken corn, you know they hide your shame. Your mouth will be like a tube. You know they hide until they follow me in the job. Eh? They hide yourself in shame. You feel say now who not, who not get sense now they do yahoo? Eh? You feel say now who not get sense now they do yahoo? Now people where get brain now they do yahoo. People where get brain because it's not easy to guide person for Nigeria. It's not easy at all. You know, you know they see what they, have they use. How many difference? How much? 500,000 naira. This one with your day. If I get like two now, they carry two motor for hand, they work out. Now so, I see him now. See you, see your guy. You the whole phone of where, where they equivalent to car. You know, get tired. You know, get tired. See, by uh, I can never envy you. You are just, uh, just, just, just imagine what you they talk. You they do, you they do uh, Nigerian one, Luca. When your mates are going international, very soon, see you. Your two hands go turn to one. Now jail you go enter. As I see you like this, huh? as I see, you, I don't see, I don't see your future. I don't see your, your with spiritual. I don't see you. Now inside jail you go and very soon. Bros, leave that thing. You they jealous me. Leave it relax. See. see, make I tell you. You know go fear envy me because you don't reach your menopause age. I swear, bet me, you know go get freedom for you. Now here you go there, I go don't make them. Don't forget, say I don't make them safe. You go still there, they, they repair this thing. Eh? Hey! Wait, 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 wait. I be joke with my answer. Hello, baby. Hello, baby. Oh, yeah, yeah, I just resumed duty. You know, the, the Indian man working on duty today is a bit healed, so they just, uh, you know, as the first uh, uh, contractor. No, it's okay. She can go ahead and mock me for all I care. It's fine. Helen, Emanuela is not mocking you. I feel she's just a bit too nervous about this marriage thing. And she meets you close by. Jay. Why do I feel like you all are in this together? In what? <clears throat> I feel like this is a setup. Because the way you're defending Emanuela, it looks like you guys are trying to set me up. Are you guys trying to set me up? 
Ellen. Emanuela is your cousin. She came to you asking for your permission to get married and you were obliged. Now she wants you to come finish up what you started. Why are you suddenly backing out? She should find someone else to be her maid of honor because I will not do her that honor. I won't. In fact, I'm not attending that with you. No, 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 just hold on a second. Wait, wait, wait. What exactly are you going to be busy doing on that day that you would not attend your cousin's wedding? Your first cousin. Not just any kind of cousin. It's Emanuela we're talking about here. I will be busy with work. And I mean it. Ellen, I have always told you that she who respects the great paves way for her own greatness. Listen, girl. You can force the sun to rise. Right? Your day shall come. I will be busy. Period. I have tried to live a very clean and upright life. I'm not a perfect person, yes, but I've lived a life that my mother and grandmother inculcated in me, which is the upright life. <sighs> While I was growing up, I tried all my best to stay away from everything immoral. I mean, I practically lived a perfect life. Why I am still not married at 40 is something that baffles me. Now I am 41, soon to be 42. What exactly do you want from me? Go straight to the point. Nothing. Sorry. I mean, you're a very beautiful girl and I think I love you. In short, I love you. And you're the most beautiful girl in our school. Really? That's where I am. Obina, how old are you? I'm 16. You're 16, right? Yeah. Mr. Romeo, so where is all this comparison coming from? I love you, that's all. <laughs> Obina, you are still a small boy and know nothing about beauty, love and friendship. I suppose you go home to your parents. I try to walk away from it. I don't understand. As you can see, I'm going home to meet my people. Is there any problem with that? I'm not supposed to say yes or no to you. Oh, you want the truth? Well, the answer is no. Are you okay? Ellen, Ellen, you can't say no to me now. You can't say no. Obina, see, the next time you stop me for this rubbish, I promise I'm going to report it to the principal. Get lost. Ellen, you have not seen the last of me. Just trust me. I was 17 then. And now, I'm 41. Still searching. Whilst Faith and Gladys are all married with kids. Gladys and her family resides in America while Faith and her family lives in Abuja. Now Joycey of yesterday will be getting married in no distant time. But I am stuck here, unmarried. Not even a man to call my own. Even when I was the most decent back then. I've had boyfriends. But none of them ever showed interest in marriage. Is either they are after my body. Or they are after my money. Or even both. 
will Richard finally be the one? Why me? Oh, why me? Oh, why me? Oh, why me? Yes, I'm here. Mwah. Mwah. How are you? I'm being busy on this. Thank you. Ah. You're welcome. Mm. So, how was your day? Very well. Went well. Yes? I had a very hectic day. Like my day was. Oh, baby. It was hectic. I'm so sorry. I can see the stress waiting all over your face. I'm going to be see, okay. That's why I asked you to come so we can chill together. Um, just to say, God's please. Waiter! Yeah, please come. Okay. Hello, Ma. Hello, my darling. How are you? Waiter, please. Take this beautiful lady's demand here and make it quick. Uh, what do you care for, Ma? Can I get a bottle of soda, please? Okay, is that all? Yes, that's all. No, no, that's not all. Hold on. Babe, come on. I'm okay with what you have here. The soda would just be fine to dilute it a bit. Okay? Sweetheart, you don't have to do it. You know how my stomach is with eating it. You know I don't want to eat it. Can we do this, please? Just this once. Just this once. Um, waiter, please, you can. A soda, please. Oh. Okay. Yeah, make it quick. So how did your day go today with the MD? How did the meeting go? Oh well, it went well. I met with the man. Uh, he was asking for 15% before he could append his signature on the contract. 15%? Honestly, my love. And what is that? This country is so corrupt. Everywhere you turn, the corruption radiates. Sweetheart, you can see that again. I mean, you needed to see how I was begging this man. Look, I pleaded with this. I almost knelt down. I almost shed tears in front of him. Ah. But he stood on his ground. Either 15% or no contract deal signed. So I, at some point, I was lost with words. I, I don't know what to do right now. What's your plan? What, how are you going to go about this now? Sweetheart, if you ask me, I don't know. But the truth is, I need this contract. I, I need this contract. I don't want this contract to slip off my hands. At least so that there will be free flow of cash. So if you need it, you go for it. You know I'm not a party to kickbacks. Mm -mm. If you need something, go for it and never stop until you get it. Yeah, I know you're right. I, I know, but... Um... Oh, you're here. Anything else you want? No, that'll be all. Thank you. You know, I... Can I have some eyes? Yeah, sure. So, you see, my dear, uh, you're right with what you said earlier before now. But, you know, the problem here is money. Yeah. I mean, I should be needing some money to sort the director and uh, some of the conglomerates. You know, this is Nigeria. Like, how much money are we looking at? Come on, baby, it's huge. It's really huge. Um, although for now I have 5 million naira, but if I can lay my hands on 10 million, it would be a go-go for me. 10 million naira, you said? Okay, so how about I get you a loan from my bank, and then the moment you get paid part of the money for the contract, you can pay up the loan. Is that okay for you? Come on, you must be joking. I mean, you shouldn't be doing that. It will be way discomforting for you. You know, baby, you, you know, no, no. This no is point. an interest-free loan. All you need to do is just pay up the money once you get payment for the contract. That way, it just takes off the entire burden from you. Seriously, this is tempting. I could have said I would Cheers. think about... To your new contract. Come on. You have you have your own way of amazing me. 
I always amaze you because I'm amazing. <laughs> Seriously? Uh huh. 10 million naira. Just keep to your own part of the bargain. Pay up the loan once you get the money. Babe, see, as soon as I'm being dispersed with this money, I'll pay it up. I will even add more interest to it. Sweetheart, you see why I love you. I, sometimes I want to be a musician, so I will sing for you in the morning, the afternoon, and night. Don't do that now. <laughs> Searching for love I went through a lot but now Thank God I found you Give me a love you And I give you a love me Mom, are you the one coming for my PTA meeting? <laughs> of course, who else would come? I want Dad to be the one to come I have told you repeatedly that your father doesn't care about you. Now, I am practically drumming it into your head that he does not care about you and I couldn't really be bothered about that. Alright? Mom, are you wishing you school? Change of school? Why? Is anyone bullying you? Your teachers? No so why do you want to have a change of school? My classmate, during the time of PTA meeting, they all come with their dad and mom. But me, I have never gone to that school with my dad. And it keeps me worried. One of my classmates has even asked me of my father. All right, so the next time any of your classmates should ask you about your father, tell the person your father has slept. But mom... But what? Is there anything that you're lacking in this house? Everything that you have asked me for, haven't I given it to you? I'm asking you, have I not given it to you? Yes, mom. Go inside. This discussion is over. Ask the inside. Your dad to come for this meeting. Yes, your dad even knows you're school. Alright, you get ready now. You're about to pop the ball. Oh, come on, babe. Come on. Just, just look at the way you spot that ball. That's enough for the day. Retired. Don't say. Are you giving up on me so soon? I'm not giving up on you, Kochi. But we have had enough to now. But today, that's for your troubles. <clears throat> Maybe I should call my dad to come play with me. Are you sure he's still around? Uh, I have to go and check. Take your chances. I'll be here. Oh, oh don't be like that now. <laughs> I'll be right back. That's okay. Yes, man. Please, I am completely green. I'm tired. What did you say? I said I'm tired. <laughs> You're tired. What did you do? Really? Yes, of course. You did nothing, babe. Besides, you couldn't even poke a ball. Is that what you're going to say to me right now? Come on, sweetheart. Trust me, do you know I was actually watching you to see how professional you can be in that game? But trust me, it was a total turn off. Listen, I have a career that I'm mastering. I'm not into games. Aww. You can say that again, my banker. Stop! <laughs> trust me, if it were to be in school days, I would say I doff my cap for you, Miss Banker. <laughs> what is that? Don't do that. Uh, I'm not interested in games that don't pay my bills. Really? Mm -hmm. So what do I call that? A workaholic, right? Babe, I haven't forgotten it took me plenty of hours to convince you to follow me there. 
Exactly. Let's even get to talk about that now. Oh, okay. I don't like the exposure that you're giving me. I'm not into games. It's not my thing. I don't like it. There she goes again. Come on, sweetheart. You're a banker. Yes, I know. But you need these exercises. You know, it's not easy for you to sit all day. I mean, you would just sit in a position and be counting money. Do you know the strength that goes out of you? Still, I do not like it and you need to stop. Honey, I love you. You know it. You are my woman in whom I'm well pleased. Look, let me break it down. Uh, I love you to the moon and back. I love you above the zone layer. And even to the firmament. Back to earth. Trust me. Seriously, babe. You, you know I hate it. I mean, I hate it each time you complain. Eh? When I try to make little effort just to put a smile on your face, you keep complaining. Okay, fine. Richard is a peaceful being. How about you go upstairs and you have your bath? No, no, no. How about we go upstairs and we have our bath together? Wow. What is what? I'm not going anywhere. Come here, baby. Stop, don't do that. Come on, upstairs. Here we go. Oh, do you mind my Lamborghini? Hop in my Lamborghini. Stop it already. I'm not going anywhere. I'm not going anywhere. Stop it. You're just a fallen angel. I love you, baby. I love you. Upstairs. I'm not going anywhere. I don't want to. Where are you this time? I'm searching for love. Hello guys, this is your girl Queen at Hilbert in Hollywood Milkshake. It's your favorite boy Jerry Williams. And I'm here to let you know where to watch I mean bangers, action movies. I need you all to subscribe to Arrow Dreams Nolly TV on YouTube. And trust me, you watch Nollywood movies is gonna be interesting. Love you guys. <laughs>